wanting to better your condition or improve yourself in some way to achieve something beyond what you've achieved so far. So are you ambitious? Oh yes, I would say so. What makes you that way? Oh, I've no idea. <laughs> Honestly, no idea. I suppose you look towards the, the normal causes, family background, the sort of intellectual furniture that you build up when you're young. Perhaps the opportunities that you encounter along the way, but um, I don't think I could ascribe it to any one cause. Just is what it is. It just is what it is, yes. Someone with a degree of foresight, you know, they can uh, picture a future that's different to the one which you might have thought was the one implied by their circumstances at the time. They know that things can be different and they're, they're willing, and they're clear-sighted about the steps that they may need to take towards that future. I say those are probably the characteristics of an ambitious person. Okay. Is there anything that would enable you to be more ambitious? Is there anything that would enable me to be more ambitious? Oh, I suppose probably a better sense of opportunities that I'm, I'd, I'd be otherwise unaware of. You know, that, that might whet the appetite, but um, otherwise I can't think of anything in particular. Okay. Do you have any views on how ambition is seen in New Zealand? Oh, it's pretty spotty here, I would say. I mean, the, the tall poppy thing is the obvious thing to, to mention, and it's real here, but it's real in lots, lots of different parts of the world where we're not unique in wanting to chop down our, our tall poppies. Um, so, yeah, but, but, but there is a sort of cultural tendency to, you know, not to be seen, to be wanting to put your head above or to be striving for something or, or to, to picture a world which is in some way better than the world in which you and your neighbours live. So I think we have those, you know, flaws within some of our cultures. I mean, some of the, the subcultures in New Zealand, I think, 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 think uh, see things very differently. I mean, think of the East Asians, for example. But in, in general, you know, traditional Kiwi culture probably doesn't place a high value on ambition unless it's something to do with sport. I mean, then it's okay. In other, in other walks of life, it's a little more suspect, I think.